Welcome to the instruction for the geometry designer and the mandala maker. There are many who feel that creating mandalas and other symmetrical designs generates a sense of balance and peace. We've developed the geometry designer and the mandala maker to have fun manipulating geometric shapes with hopes you achieve a better sense of balance throughout the rest of your day. We've given you a head start by providing a few shapes for you to manipulate. You can manipulate these shapes using gizmos. Click on any shape and a gizmo will appear. There are three types of gizmos, move, rotate and resize. The move gizmo. Select the object and press the W key on your keyboard. In this instance, the move gizmo was already selected. Grab the arrow handles and drag your mouse in the direction of the arrow. The rotate gizmo. Select the object and press the A key on your keyboard. Click and drag your mouse along the circle in the direction you want your shapes to rotate. The resize gizmo. Select the object and press the R key on your keyboard. Notice there are three handles. The center gray square allows you to resize the entire shape symmetrically. The other, red and green squares stretch the shape along their direction. You can also change the color, select different shapes, copy and remove rows and items by using these items on the left. Click on the triangle, or curate, and it opens up the interface for its row. Here, you can change the color. Change the shape. Add or subtract the number of elements. Copy the entire row of elements. And delete the row of elements. Notice, when I click on this section that the gizmo pops up on its row. Here, this button makes the lines thinner. This button makes the lines thicker. This is the undo button. This button resets the camera, so, let's talk about the camera position. You use your scroll wheel to move forwards or backwards. You can right click to use your mouse to pan the view. And clicking on the reset camera button moves the view back to its original location. Play mode. Play mode shows off rotation and fade effects. You can select the rotation type in the blinking type. The top slider represents the speed and direction of the rotation. The bottom slider controls the time for the shapes to fade in. Here's rotate alternate and now here's the blink effect. Click play. The sliders and play button disappear for a full screen experience. You can save your work by clicking the file icon. You can upload previous work by using the upload button. You can change the background by selecting this button, and then selecting your background. I hope you enjoyed this instruction and I hope you have fun playing with geometric designs.